With the formal entry by the Speaker and the approval of votes and proceedings for the day's plenary, the leader of government business, Oye Kola Bodiade Oye, moved a motion for the confirmation of the two officers of the House, which was seconded by Ade Oye Aribasoye, representing Ikole Constancy too, premising this on the need to fill the vacant positions. And I rise this morning to hold this motion that Mr. Francis to Robert Afonabi be confirmed as the executive secretary of the British State House of Assembly Service Commission and Mrs. Kenny Sola Titi Lomaya as deputy clerk representative of the State House of Assembly. I arise this morning to support the motion calling for the confirmation of Mr. Francis to Dr. Fahami as the Executive Secretary of the State House of Assembly Commission. The newly appointed Executive Secretary, Mr. Francis Tulilope Afolabi, was the former Director of Information Services of the State House of Assembly Commission. The Assembly also confirmed appointment of Mrs. Titi Lope Agbede as Deputy Clerk, Legislative Service. The lawmakers unanimously supported the motion for the confirmation of these two staff on the basis of the nominee's capacity, experience, and the ability to deliver, having worked with them for over three years. The Speaker, Olubumi Adiluba, congratulated and challenged the newly appointees to ensure that they deliver on the mandate given to them. Also, at the plenary, the House subjected three bills to the first reading, which include Ekiti State Local Government Staff Loan Bill 2023, Ekiti State Wealth Fund Bill 2023, and Ekiti State Fire Service Bill 2023. From the State House of Assembly, Ayodi Jogunshaki, NTA News.